guys, it's us. Welcome back to another vlog here in Singapore. So today's video, we will be exploring Chinatown. Yeah, so a lot of you guys recommended that we visit Singapore's Chinatown for cheap eats. And if you know us well, we love to eat and also we love cheap things. Yeah, exactly. So this place is perfect for us. Yes. So yeah, let's go explore Singapore's Chinatown. Another day, another adventure. Let's go. Okay, so we're here. We're here to the grab driver. He was so aggressive. Reckless. Yeah, he was so reckless. Yeah. And then once we got off, I saw that he only had like two stars. And I was like, oh, that's why. <laughs> yeah. yeah, anyways, we are finally in Chinatown. And first impression of this place, it is so vibrant here. Yeah. Wow, I love Chinatown. Honestly, I love Chinatown anywhere. Yeah. Like any country. Yeah. They just have amazing food and just the vibe, the overall vibe is so sick. Yeah. Guys. So far, I see so many variety of things. They have like fruit, they have like souvenirs, they have like clothes right here, they have they even have noodles right here. There's so many varieties, it's so insane. My grandma would love this. She collects these things. What is it? Like just antiques like this. She used to have like this shelf. I think every grandma did. Like a big shelf of just like antiques. <laughs> I highly recommend you guys to come here before you leave Singapore because you can get a lot of pasalubo. Yeah. Right? For cheap. For cheap, yeah. This place reminds us a lot of Divisoria or Green Hills in the Philippines. Mm -hmm. Lots of um, cheap things, but cool things at the same time. 90% of the things that are here, I've never seen before. Yeah, very, very unique yeah. and antique thing. Yeah, like, look damn. at this, look at this. Like, what is that? It's like, a Singapore on there. Yeah, I don't know what it is, but I think it would look good in my room. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder how much these are. The little oh, ones are $15. Mahal. Oh, 15 the, bucks, the look, guys. Are $15, so I assume that they go up as they get bigger. That's cool though. Yeah. I want this one. I like this one. This, this one says Singapore. <laughs> There's like a random bird right here. Look. How much is he? How much is he? What is he doing? He's trying to get out. Oh yeah, he's trying to get out. Like I said, unique things out here. We highly recommend coming here in the morning or just like us, we came here in the right? And it's not hot. Yeah. Yeah. It's overcast as well. So maybe that's why it's not too hot. But we literally just got here and we're already distracted by like all the stalls selling I know. things. I feel like 20 feet pa lang tayo from where we started. Yeah. And there's just like so much to see already. Yeah. We just had to keep stopping yeah. at every damn store. <laughs> <laughs> so vibrant. Like Jan said, so vibrant and colorful here. It's yeah. So nice. We love it. Okay, so nandito kami ngayon sa loob ng Chinatown complex. So it's like a mall in here, mm -hmm. no? And then upstairs is a food court. Yeah, lots of clothes for sale. Parang mall. Ooh, I can smell different spices already. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, here we are. Damn, yes. there's a lot of stalls here. I think they call this like a hawker center or something. Wow, there's so many food stalls. Let's go try it out. Let's go.
compared to the foods that we've been eating around Singapore, this place is so cheap. I know, why didn't we come here earlier? <laughs> I know, honestly, I'm glad we're here now. Yeah. Per meal, they range from three to five dollars. Yeah. And they look amazing, guys. Big portions too, yeah. from what I can see. Yeah, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. There's so many options, so many choices. Yeah, the whole second floor of this complex is literally just stalls upon stalls upon stalls of food. Yeah, it's crazy. There are like different types of restaurants. Yeah. So many choices. I love it. I love it. A few moments later. Nagana kami ng ATM right now. Wala pala kami pera. Naiwan namin sa hotel. We're like buying and we're like, where's our money at? All right. So the first stall we will be trying is Song. Lamian Shang Long Bao. Sorry, <laughs> sorry in advance if I'm saying that wrong. We actually saw a video of Mark Weens eating here. Yeah, so, so we knew it must be good. Yeah, and he said many good things about this stall, so we're here. Yeah. First stall for today's food vlog. looks amazing oh my gosh it smells amazing thank you Mark Weens all right so we got our food but we obviously need a drink there's a stall right here they sell fruit juices and I got the mango juice it's quite cheap it's only two dollars and fifty cents so let's see it We got the beef noodle and then the spicy wonton. I'm not sure if I'm gonna like that because I can't handle spicy foods as much as I try. I just can't handle it, but I'm gonna try it anyway. And then we got mango juice. So far we've spent $13.50, but look how much we got for $13 already. I feel like this will feed both of us, but if you were by yourself, you probably could spend less. So time to take the glasses off. Why? It's time to eat. Why take the glasses off? So it doesn't get it doesn't get foggy. Okay. Yeah, so quite excited. This smells amazing. I'm gonna give the beef noodle a try first. Actually I'm gonna give this a try first because I'm the opposite of Anne. I love spicy food, so it's been looking at me. It looks amazing with the chili oil. Look at that. Ooh. Mmm. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Mmm, 10 out of 10. It's not even that spicy babe, I think you'll like it. One more, one more, one more. Good. Oh my goodness. Okay, so it's my turn to try the dumpling. Like I said, I'm not a fan of spicy foods. I do like some spicy foods, but my tongue just can't handle it. I'm gonna try it out anyway. Jan really hyped it up, so also, I can't use chopsticks and they don't have a fork. Don't judge me. So what do I do? Just like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like that makes it spicier, no? No, 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 it's good. Okay. It's just chili oil. That is good. That's amazing. That's really good. It's spicy though. Followed up with mango juice. I know what Jan's talking about now. Yeah. It's actually really good. And it's, isn't it like perfectly cooked? Like it's yeah. not hard. It's yeah. just like, it's soft. Like it melts in your mouth. It's spicy though. Yeah. All right, so it's time to try the beef noodle. I don't want it to get cold, you know? Man, it smells amazing. Give me some of that $2 mango juice. The mango juice is actually really good. The mango, wow. Mm. 
It's literally like drinking out of a mango. Wow, you're right. It's yeah. literally like a poke a straw in a mango. It's just there. That is so refreshing. Wow, really good. Okay, so time to try the beef noodle with the chili oil. I'm not gonna spread it so Anne can enjoy it too. <laughs> Let's try the broth first. I had too much chili. <laughs> That's really flavorful. Dude, okay. That's really good. And for five dollars? Look, look how big this is, guys. So we've been in Singapore for like a few days now. It's quite expensive. It ranges from around 10 to 15 dollars per meal. And this is what? Five dollars for this bowl? Look at that. That's a lot of food. And it's super tasty, like no complaints. I haven't even had like the beef yet. I've just had the broth. Mm. Get some chili oil. Wow, that's really, really good. Okay, so it's Anne's turn to try the beef noodle. Got a fork. I'm just gonna put that aside. You spread the chili oil. Try the meat. Mm hmm It's already so tasty. And it's just the noodles I got. That's tasty. Right? Yeah. It's good. It's good. Spicy. <laughs> But it's good. For the price too? Mm -hmm. We killed it. Yes. Yes, you did. Okay, so Anne's just gonna put the tray away. Guys, I'm so glad we decided to come to Chinatown and see this part of Singapore. This place is amazing. And if you want to save money on food, then definitely come here. Like, how do they make money? Because Singapore is expensive, right? I don't know. I guess it's so cheap, people want to come here. <laughs> I guess, like, even though it's on the cheaper side, so many people come yeah. daily. That's where they make their money, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Right? Because there's so many people that buy from them. Yeah. Maybe that's it, right? Maybe that's it. But honestly, guys, like, we're so full right now just from that meal. Yeah, that so honestly, you could have just spent like ten dollars at this food court, and that's for alone. both of us. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so it's like five, like what, like six dollars each, because mm -hmm. we spent thirteen bucks. Yeah. So as you can see, it is a pretty popular stall because look at the line. We're done with the first stall. Now we are gonna be getting some food street fried koi tio mi. Koi tio mi. Yeah, so once again, I think we're pronouncing it wrong, so don't judge us. But it looks amazing, and there's people lined up here once again, so we had to come go where the line is, right? <laughs> so you know what is good. But yeah, so we're gonna take out and probably buy some more souvenirs. Some more. Alright, so we're out now. Oh man, it's super hectic up there. Since there's so many stalls, there's so many people eating, um, enjoying their time and enjoying the food. Now that we're out here, honestly we love walking around Singapore, anywhere in Singapore. Mm -hmm. We always felt safe, no? Yeah, that's one thing we did notice here in Singapore is that it's super safe. You yeah. feel super safe, especially at night. Yeah. Um, we did read online as well that Singapore is one of the safest countries and cities in the world. So.
guys, may nagbebenta ng durian dito. Ann and I. Oh. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hello, hello. How much for your durian? This one uh, is the one kilo for 28. 28? How much yeah. is that? This one uh, is the eight dollar. Eight yeah. dollars for the thing? Yes. Okay, maybe later when we come back. Yeah, this is yeah. the Musang King. Uh, this one. Musang. Oh, okay. What's behind is the like a star. Uh, oh, okay. So this is the Musang King. And then the price is the one kg for. $48. Oh, okay, this is more. Yeah, this is this is the king of the durian. Durian, okay. Yeah, so very nice. It's the sweet and bitter and the soft and creamy. Oh, okay. Yeah, so very nice. Okay. Uh, so you can try this one. <laughs> right. Maybe nice. in a bit. Thank okay. you. We'll just walk around. So Anne and I, we've actually had durian before. Our first impression of it, it smells. Oh, it, it has it a tastes, strong smell. It has a sm strong smell. To me, it's it tastes like onion, onion. like onion, onion and onion. pork. And oh, uh, I, I did honestly, it wasn't bad, mm -hmm. but it wasn't great either. You know what I've noticed here in Singapore is that they love their durian. They have yeah. durian everything. For lunch today, they had this like durian dessert, and it's like it's a cream. Yeah, and I yeah. didn't know what I was eating. I literally just like put it in my mouth because it's dessert. I love dessert. I just <laughs> put it in my mouth, and it instantly like like attacked my mouth with its strong scent. I was like, ooh. Jan is not a fan of it, but yeah. for me, like, it's not bad. It's just very, very strong. Anne wants a picture right here. side of Chinatown. This is An Siang Hill, if I'm not mistaken. Super cute neighborhood. They have a lot of cafes and bars on this corner and super aesthetic as well. Okay, so this part of Singapore, we kind of just found it. What is the An Tiang Hill? <laughs> An Siang. Oh, An Siang Hill. Yeah. This reminds me so much of San Francisco. Oh yeah. Right? Yeah. It does. It's giving me San Francisco vibes. Oh man, it's unfortunately our last few days here in Singapore. But man, for a small country, it has so much to offer. Yeah. So far, my favorite thing about Singapore is the food. Mm -hmm. The food here Super is amazing. Good, yeah. No? It's good. It's so good. Like, Singapore food's good. Yeah. <laughs> it's lit. No, literally, like, there's lights now, which is so much prettier. So it is now 7 p.m. and I think it's time to call it a night. Even though it's still quite early, it's getting way too busy here now. And we basically done everything now. We got delicious food, we got some souvenirs, mm -hmm. and we got to explore a little bit of Singapore's Chinatown. Yeah. We had an amazing day. Highly, highly recommend that you guys visit Singapore's Chinatown if you're ever in Singapore. Mm -hmm. So as always, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And follow us on social media for daily updates. Yeah, till next time. Peace!